everyone, welcome back to Kingdom Hearts Collections. This is a video series where I chronicle stuff, videotape stuff, and the Kingdom Hearts things in the Kingdom Hearts games you might not know about, and Mr. Bill is in the way. Sorry. Alrighty, so I'm gonna be doing kind of, uh, I'm Oogie Boogie's Manor. There's quite a few things here, and I'm just actually gonna do kind of like showing off me, uh, going through it. Because that's going to be funny. Because this. I love this level, but at the same time, it's fucking horrendous. Like, you fall down, it's like, shit, man, it takes fucking forever. Well, not really, but if you get all the way to the top. Because, uh, for one thing, for anyone, say, if they're following along or something, and you're playing the PS2 version. There's a difference between, there's a difference here between the PS2 and PS3 versions. I'm doing this on the PS3 version, so it's not going to show it here, but in this room, on this thing here, in the PS2 version, there is a red trinity. Now, you absolutely have to get this red trinity before you fight the boss of this world, because, spoilers, the house disappears. So if you don't get this Red Trinity in the PS2 version right here, right now, you lose it forever. They fixed that in 1.5 by... <sighs> Gotta go down here. They put the Red Trinity down here. Now, the thing is that that though is, um... In the journal, when you get it, it the journal will show that you've gotten it. But occasionally, the Red Trinity doesn't go away. Um, oh, fucking, I wish I had counterattacks so bad, but I chose the shield because I'm on crowd mode. Um, oh my god. Bathtub? Um, yeah, so that's where the new Red Trinity placement is. Fuck, go away. New Red Trinity placement here. So you can see the chest is up there. I don't have Goofy. Fuck me. Damn it. Alright. Tub. You will see Oh, that's right. And Kinson and because the tub it, getting into the tub and going back up here is a cutscene, it resets the heartless here. <sighs> so fucking stupid. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be showing off everything in here until up to the Oogie Boogie fight. Because there's like a whole bunch of treasure chests and stuff around here that um, I'm pretty sure that if you don't get all of them, they show up in this like little like nook um after the house is destroyed but i'm not sure if i've missed any treasure chests here so this this right here this fucking gargoyles like in the fucking trees can't get to them and no <laughs> fucking kill me man just oh, and you can't get into the fucking tub that's the, that's like one of the most annoying things about Kingdom Hearts 1 is that you can't fucking do anything until all the Heartless are fucking destroyed. Oh, uh, by the way, this is also my, uh, <laughs> Rage Quit audition, which keeps me looking for some <laughs> you to do Rage Quit. Look at me. I'm kidding. Oh my god, I have to fight the fucking, fucking White Knights again. Oh my god. Oh, I guess it doesn't reset. I guess I just didn't... Hmm. Huh. Well, what do you know? I was wrong. No. Nope. Uh. Get on the fucking... So this is gonna be kind of a long bit video. And look, they reset! Oh wait, no, I actually didn't kill it. Never mind. Ow! There we go. I mean, I really like the design of Oogie Boogie's house. I think it's like fucking sweet, man. 
para. Uh, I can't see. Ah! Stop jumping. Alrighty. Can isn't there something? I always think there's something in there, but there isn't. Already. Let's go this way. So, <laughs> not gonna. All right, come over here, piece of shit. All right, one more go. <laughs> All right. Okay. God, it's like scary trying to like navigate around here, and you want to get all the treasure chests. How do I get in there? Oh, wait. Don't fall! Oh dear. How do I get in there? I know you can get in there. Um. <laughs> it looks like Jack is wearing a giant hat. Um. Let's see. Oh, god damn it. You can't actually get in there, can you? Ooh! Um. All right, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Oh, oh okay, you can jump on here, okay. There we go, okay, so that's how you get that treasure chest, which is a mega ether. And then, oh, so these were the two treasure chests come from. Yeah, okay, so I never, I never get these two treasure chests because one of them is like hard to reach. Uh, the other one you can only reach by glide. So any treasure chests that do not that you do not get show up in this little like hole thing like after you've beaten the world. So all right, I love how that one's like lurking in the trees. <laughs> Also, why did the search ghost show up in Atlantica? I find that so odd and out of place. Come on. Can you actually stand on that tree? I don't want to find out. No. My synthesis item. My cabbages. Now, this, if I recall, is like one of the most annoying, like, places to like actually like fight the fucking heartless. I'm just gonna here. All right, where? All right, no. Lock, shock, and barrel, guys. Oh, I knocked out Lock pretty- oh wait, oh, she's alive. These guys are a lot more annoying in Kingdom Hearts 2 with the boxes. Alright, hey, that wasn't that bad. I'll behave, I promise. I feel so bad for Beryl. Like, his, like, dialogue is, like, so sad. And then they like blame him. It's all Beryl's fault. And then if you go to, um, if you talk to Beryl after you finish this world, he goes, I, it's like, I don't like pulling pranks, but I don't want to be left out. It's like, Beryl, oh, so sad. Alrighty, so. Oogie Boogie, you told us not to give away his hiding place. Oh, we're not supposed to talk about the lover either. Yeah, so, pull this. I'm gonna save real fast. So, pseudo let's play, I guess? I don't know. Also, if you notice, I, like, I fixed my lighting problem with the towel. Um, alright. Mm -hmm. 
<clears throat> now there's a few extra little areas around here that oh holy shit you can't stand on this tree that's cool all right um i know where the player uh where Oogie is, I just, there's like some extra stuff. Um. This here. Which, what's the point of this? This looks like a place just for me to get frustrated and fall off. I think, uh, oh my god, oh my god, no, 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 no. And there I go. I mean, I found Ogi's place. Isn't there something else here? Like, you go and... That's what I was thinking of. You get sucked into that. Alright. No heartless show up, please? Okay. You go in here, you examine, you get sucked up to some other part of the cat, or the manor. Right in front- oh! Ah, yes, okay. That's right, okay. And you get an Ori Calcum from there. You could, uh, you could jump. Don't recommend it. You probably make it, and you'll probably, but you, you might fall down and all that. But so, yeah, okay, so I actually got one of the treasure chests I never get before, so that's pretty cool. And, uh, so here's the, oh, it's in the shape of a Oh, cool. At least Donald casts arrow a lot. Heal me though. All right, yeah. So this is the entrance into Oogie Boogie's Manor. I'm not gonna be um, filming that just because I know that they're not battles that will require me to be like super uber like mad. And yelling so anyway so this is this episode of kingdom hearts collections if i've missed anything let me know and i thank you very much for watching